Hey, welcome to another show. Today we're going to be talking about addition properties. That's when we're going to add two numbers to find the sum. So for example, when I take the numbers 2 plus 5, these right here, these are called the add-ins. And the sum is what these two atoms equal. So 2 plus 5 equals 7. So this is the sum, and this is called the add-ins. Okay? You can add numbers in any order. The sum is the same. For example, 2 plus 5 equals 7, and I can take these two add-ins, switch them around, so 5 plus 2 equals 7. Well, we're going to take a domino here and turn it over, and we're going to see some dots on that domino. So right now I'm going to count these dots here. I have 1, 2, 3, 4. And I'm going to mark those dots right here on my board. 1, 2, 3, 4. And on this side we have six dots. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. So I'm going to take this number, which is four, and put that right here. And take this number, which is six dots, and put that here. These numbers right here are called the add-ins. So four plus six, equals 10. And you can take 4 plus 6. 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. So now what I'm going to do is take these numbers here, these dots, and turn them that way. So now I have the 6 dots here, and I put 6 here, and I have the 4 dots here. 1, 2, 3, 4. So 6 plus 4, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. This also equals 10. These are called the add-ins, the 6 and the 4, and the 10 is called the sum. All right, let's try another one here. Can you see how many dots there are right here? Can you count them? Right, three. One, two, three. And can you count these? Correct, there are five. One, two, three, four, five. So I put three right here, and the five right here. These are the two add ins. So three plus five equals. Correct. Eight. And if I take this domino and turn it around, I'll have five right here and three right there. So five, six, seven, eight. So we're seeing that we can add numbers in any order and the sum is the same. I really like adding domino numbers, dots, because I picture, like the four, I picture this in my mind and it's easy for me to count numbers. For example, when I take six plus four, I can imagine the six dots in my mind. This is one strategy I use to add numbers. Let's go ahead and do one more. Let's count the dots. One, two, three, four. And, oh, this is a tricky one. I don't see any dots here. So that means it is zero, and I don't have to put anything right there. So I take the four dots, which would be four, and zero. Four plus zero, these are the two add-ins. So four plus nothing equals 4. Then I can 
switch this around. Here we have 0, and we have 4. 0 plus 4 equals 4. These are the two add-ins. This is the sum. And once again, we can add numbers in any order. Sum is the same. When you add a 0 to a number, the sum is always that number. All right, I hope this helped you out a little bit. Thanks a lot for watching the show today. Please check out my other videos on here. I have other educational and math videos. And like always, have a fun day. Bye-bye.